So students find redox reactions one of the more challenging ideas in chemistry. So in this video, we're going to talk about a redox reaction calculator, an online calculator that can help you learn to solve redox reactions. So let's take a look at one. Say we have this equation right here, and we're asked to balance this using the redox methodology. So we'll go to our online calculator. This is the one I like. And the link to this calculator for balancing redox reactions is in the description of this video if you need that. So we'll come down to equation and we're going to put the redox reaction in there. And since we have HNO3, HNO3, that's a strong acid. It's going to be an acidic medium. And we submit and we have this step-by-step -step explanation of how to balance the redox reaction. It shows us the oxidation numbers, how they change, we do our half reactions, and then just go through how we add electrons, how we deal with hydrogen ions and with water. Ultimately, we go through these steps, and you know there are a lot of steps with redox reactions, and we end up with the balanced equation. So what's really powerful about this is someone trying to learn to do a redox reaction. What I recommend you do is first, when you have your redox reaction, for example this here, try to balance this yourself and do the best you can. Then go back and look and see where you're having problems. If it's with the oxidation numbers, you need to learn more about oxidation numbers. But if you're getting those right, maybe your half reactions are the problem and you need to spend more time learning the half reactions and so on. So as you step your way through this process, these steps of solving redox reactions, then make sure you get the correct answer in the end. And you have a lot of resources. You have your textbook, you have your teacher, your notes from class and your peers to work on this together. Redox reactions are very challenging to balance and something like this online redox calculator it can help you. It's a tool to help you learn to do redox reactions. But remember, you won't have this on the test. This is Dr. B talking a little bit about a redox calculator, redox reaction calculator you can find online. Thanks for watching.